Children of County Cork National School have been asked to bring their own toilet paper to school. The principal of St John's Girls National School in Carrigaline says it's just one of several measures the school has been forced to implement in a bid to offset funding cutbacks. Spending a penny at school these days has become a very real financial issue. With over 540 students here at the Girls' National School in Carrigaline, the bill for toilet rolls can run into the thousands. That's why the principal wrote to parents last week, asking them to send in the occasional toilet roll if they could in a bid to offset costs. Many grants that we received, such as library book grants to supply library books for classes, that has been taken away from us, um, also uh, computer grants and indeed grants for free books. If we can save some money by having parents bring in toilet rolls, we can use that money for other educational purposes and that was the idea behind it. Swine flu precautions have also added to the school's costs. And with the swine flu the children are being told with guidelines to blow their nose as much as possible and bin it and they're small children and some children actually don't bring it in or can't bring it in. Um, so they're just going through it here like wildfire, really. The INTO says the request is not unusual, and parents waiting in the rain outside said they were surprised, but not angry with the school. Something you don't expect. But do you blame the school, or who do you blame? Not the, definitely not the school. If they haven't got the budget for it, then a fish stinks from its head. It's the government. You know, it's cutbacks. We just have to do it. We've no other choice. If we have to, the kids, kids need toilet paper in school, we're going to have to supply it at the end of the day. Yesterday, the girls in Class 1 brought in one toilet roll. Today, they brought in 18 rolls, and the shelf is likely to fill up by the end of the week. As parents here, as parents all over the country, respond to a very real need in their local school. Jenny O'Sullivan, RTE News, Carrigaline Girls National School. A 42-year-old Limerick man has been jailed for three years on charges of assault and cruelty against his five-year-old son and ten-year-old daughter. David McGurk of High Meadows, Guldevohar in Limerick, had told lies to Gorthy about his children's injuries.